In this video, I'm going to show you some free Blender resources that you probably didn't know about. So without further ado, let's get started with some free add-ons. First of all, we have Simplicage, which is an add-on we talked about in an earlier video. This Blender add-on can quickly generate physics-ready gauges for your models. It has a free version that offers gauges for your characters clean selection and remeshing, collision boxes, and the ability to add single bone for a cache. Procedural Slime Add-on for Blender This add-on will basically create procedural slime between objects. It comes with a bunch of parameters to control the slime, like density that changes the number of slime tentacles between the objects, velocity that changes the effect of gravity on the slime, and radius that changes the radius of the slime tentacles and so much more. All the parameters are further explained on the Gumroad page and Artishock, the creator of the add-on, also made a video explaining the installation process and all the parameters. The link for the Gumroad page is in the description below. Thanks Blender add-on. Thanks Blender add-on is an integrated search engine for Blender that allows you to search for pre-built models and meshes so that you can save time in your creative workflow process. You can then navigate to Thanks and import your desired model. The viewport can display preview of all the models found on Thanks in the add-on. MeshDraw MeshDraw is a new free geometry node graph that lets you draw meshes along curves any mesh can be instanced, wrapped and stretched along each stroke of a curve. The goal was to make a geometry nodes tool that's not specific to making one thing, but it's rather more general purposed by wrapping meshes instead of generating them. You have more control over your triangle count and your UV mapping and you still get to enjoy some of the benefits of a more procedural workflow. Scott Jones, the creator of the add-on, has a detailed video with different examples for the use cases of the add-on. You can check out the video on the Gumroad page linked in the description. IV Pen Add-on for Blender You can guess from the name that the add-on allow you to create IVs in Blender. The add-on is also made by Artishock, so the installation and the creation process is quite similar to the slime generator. Also, it comes with tons of parameters to work with. And as always, Artishock offers a detailed explanation for the installation process, the utilization, and for the different parameters on the Gumroad page and in a YouTube video. One Click Rig one Click Rig is a Blender add-on designed for fast converting characters from one program to another. You can use it to edit animation and edit armatures as well. The add-on is really simple to use and install. You can check the video made by Artem Poltsky, creator of the add-on, for more details on that. Blender 3.3 Beta Hair plus Geometry Notes this is a geometry node setup created by Adiden to add children, thickness, clumping, radius, roughness, and randomized length to the new hair system of Blender 3.3 or higher using Blender geometry nodes. Just note that this is just a temporary solution while we wait for the official release, but it is a really good idea to create hair with geometry nodes. Now let's do a quick run through of some really cool resources that you can download right now. Medieval Voxel Assets currently has 52 pieces to make medieval environments where you can find from walls to towers, houses and small simple stores. Free Massive Decal Pack for Blender This pack comes with a complete guide of how to use the decals in each software. Decals include 11 gravity styles, 6 grunge, 3 blood, and 2 rust decals. And for more decals, you can also check out 570 sci fi decals that offers 20 free samples of its massive decals collection. Free bundle, damage, leak, crack, and imperfection. A collection of destruction brushes that are classified in different categories as leak, crack, imperfection and damage 
With the help of these brushes, bring your material processing closer to reality in the shortest possible time. Lastly, we have a procedural material by Kubocate, which is a deteriorated bricks material. This procedural material could be altered and modified according to your wish and also can potentially be turned into any types of bricks. This procedural material looks highly realistic and it has an optimized general node to get the best variation the easiest way possible. Now, if you want to check out these resources, links are in the description. Tell me in the comments below which add-on or assets you like the most. Don't forget to subscribe. Thank you for watching and goodbye.